All right. <clears throat> News nonsense. Quick one. How much would you expect to be the most expensive wine bottle ever sold? At oh, an Lord. auction. At, at an auction. I'd easily go with a few million. <clears throat> Not that high. It was a Sotheby's uh, a, from 1945 wine bottle, $558,000. Hmm. Okay. But here's the thing. The person who buys that, and if he drinks it, the ultimate destination of that money is down the toilet. <laughs> literally. Quite literally. <laughs> Quite literally. That's the funny part. So if it is a multi-billionaire, you real, a millionaire, you realize you just literally threw your money down, you flushed it down the toilet. I think it's ridiculous. Yeah. I mean, if you buy a car or something tangible. Well, I, I mean, yeah. you got to understand how collectors work, though. And I'm actually, I'm working, <clears throat> I'm building a wine site right now for somebody. Oh. And it's like the most complicated website I've ever put together. Wine, you, okay. We have regions, like portfolios in regions, and then producers within those regions. And then they produce wines with different grapes. And then there's veritals, and then there's appellations. And then there's colors, and it's just like I had to figure out how to develop a WordPress database to <laughs> accumulate all this stuff together. And I actually pulled it off. It was uh, it's actually the most impressive piece of software I've done. Nice. <laughs> Take a look at Joe Johnson's comment on the wine. Uh, literally, yeah, I um, can't. Yeah, Family Channel, but right, Joe, that's that's the funny part. You literally throw, him, but I guess if you're worth billions, yeah, okay, it's it's like you know five dollars for him. Find his comment. <laughs> uh, all right. Nice. <laughs> Let's see what else I have here. Okay, nonsense number two out of three. This one I find it hard to believe, but I guess it does, it really happened. A passenger plane. Okay. <laughs> I'm laughing now, but a pilot on takeoff hits a wall, but keeps on going. <laughs> Literally hits a wall, a piece of a wall, keeps on going, but it gets better. He hit a wall at a piece of a tower on takeoff. Did he get his license through Xbox or Microsoft Flight Simulator? No, no, no. It was a Cracker Jack box. Remember Cracker Jack? Uh, yes, I do. But he, hits yeah. the, but he keeps on going. He doesn't want to turn around. So what does the captain say? Ladies and gentlemen, that thump you heard was us knocking out a tower and a wall. It was freaking awesome. Have no fear. We will arrive at your destination in four hours. Uh, unless I actually caused the damage to the plane, which but case does, we'll decompress midair. <laughs> but what does the control tower say? Captain Snapperhead, if it's not too much trouble, would you mind turning your freaking plane about? There's like wires hanging out the unbelly. <laughs> what kind of pilots? <laughs> Bleep it. We're going, folks. He did turn around after two hours later. Really? It took two hours to figure out? Gee, I got a hole in the plane. Think that's going to be a problem there, Captain? Anyway, wow. do not fly Air India planes, because that's where it was. Nice. <laughs> God. Come again. Thank you. <laughs> Come again. Thank you for flying. Uh, Thump Airlines. But a bum bum. Nice. All right. And my last one. Uh, this is for PS4 users, uh, PlayStation 4. They're saying that a text message hack is causing their consoles to crash, go into a loop. Uh, there's something in the message, the malicious code, uh, that's causing this to, um, well, their systems crash. All I can say is, I guess, the gamers got the message, <laughs> as it were. But yeah, if you are a PlayStation 4 user, you may want to go to the help forums, because if you got a text message and your, comp your thing crashes, I don't know if there's a workaround. Probably is by now. But... Some people have way too much time on their hands writing malicious code mm -hmm. for PlayStation 4. Yeah, well, you know. you know, that's the original spirit of hacking was just pranks and jokes. So. Yeah, I guess so.